welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel hi my name is nadia i might be like the weirdest person you've ever met but it's all right it's only um camera you know anyways um if you're new to my channel please subscribe that would be very awesome like the most awesome thing um but if you're new to my channel please subscribe and um i hope you enjoy this video so today what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to do a beauty beauty guru routine where i'm going to be showing us how to do a full face of makeup without even trying and you'll be looking like a natural beauty without even trying so it'll be like a makeup no makeup look and i'll be doing a look where i'm oh i need that I'm really sorry about that. As I was saying, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do um, a very simple makeup routine thingy without even trying. I just want to show you guys my vanity and my makeup station. I mean, it's really, really aesthetic and it's really, really organized. And there's my toilet. So I think it really matches together. And that's my sink. And that is me. So thank you for appreciating my makeup station okay now that i'm done now that i'm done showing you guys my kylie jenner look-alike makeup station i'll be showing you guys how to do this makeup routine that i'm talking about so the first thing you want to do is make sure your face is very moisturized i already added some moisturization on my face so now it's moist like a chicken and um i really really i'm gonna be serious but i really really prefer this like this is so good for makeup this chunk of thing you can get from you can get it at Costco and and anywhere else but like Costco has the big ones and we always want the big ones and this one is so good like for makeup like highly recommend okay once your face is really moisturized you want to do this once your face is really moisturized you want to take some Vaseline and you guys would be like what are you gonna do with that Vaseline Vaseline is key to natural beauty like natural beauty so what are we gonna do with this is we're gonna literally add that where your highlighter is okay and when i tell you add that where your highlighter is you add it on okay and i'm just gonna have use my um, palette just to look at myself because this palette is so bougie and it works so well so you just want to add it there and it just the reason why is because Vaseline just has this really good texture and it just softens your skin and it just has this glow thingy and I don't know where that glow comes from but that glow is precious okay and next thing you want to do is you want to take some lip balm you want to take that lip balm and just snatch it on your lips because you always want to moisturize your lips before putting the makeup on because then your lips will have time to really um basically swallow all that moisture and then plump it out of your lips if that makes sense so now that your skin is nice and highlighted with the vaseline i already added mascara so like it looks like i don't have mascara but i do and it's really natural you see that it's a really natural uh, mascara so that's already done so the next thing you want to do is you want to take some blush I'm using the Clinique chubby stick and this thing is key to natural beauty as well so what you want to do is you want to take this and you want to add it on your hand like that Ooh, what did I say and then um, you want to take this and I'm just going to take my mirror it's really dirty but you know what dirty makes everything better um, and you're just going to do, you just, you literally can't see anything on my face, which is awesome. Okay. <laughs> you literally can't see my makeup. So I don't know what to do about it. So anyway, you want to take that chubby cheek and just add it in there. You literally can't see anything. Like I'm so stupid. Okay, I found a different station with better lighting, I guess. I don't know. But once you're done with the blush, you really want to make sure it's in there because blush really just helps with that glowy factor. 
So I'm gonna put it on my nose so I look more bronzed basically. I don't know what that means, but just gonna add that in there. And with the Vaseline, it just makes it so natural. Like, let me tell you, like, Anyways, next thing you want to do is you're going to take some highlighter and you're going to add a little bit of highlighter on top of your Vaseline, your Vaseline, okay, your Vaselina. So I'm using, let me show you what I'm using. I'm using the L'Oreal Paris, the L'Oreal Paris highlighter. And I, it's really, really, it's really, really, you know, really, really. And we're just gonna add that in there. Oof, girl. I be looking bougie. I be looking bougie. Ooh, boo, bougie. Cutie. Cheek. Okay, that makes no sense. And just literally put that anywhere because this one just makes you look so natural. And just go like that. It's really. Oh, shoot. Okay. You know what's Okay. You know what's so annoying is highlighters like every highlighter is different. Like I can all highlighters just be good? Like just why do I have to go in a store and try out a hundred highlighters? Like just make them all the same and make them perfect. Like how how hard is that job? I don't understand. Oh my god, no, look, look, what is this? I bought this for $4 and this is what it gives me. <sighs> I'm not trying to look lighter. I'm trying to look shinier. Anyway, it is what it is. Oh, it is what it is. Um, next thing you want to do is I have this thing. And I don't know what exactly this is, but it's really bright and shimmery. So you want to take this middle one and this one really goes well with mine so this one just adds a pop of like glitter i guess if that makes any sense i don't know what i'm doing um you see and it's also really natural so this one just in the light will give you a more oof while the other one gives you a highlight well this one gives you a oof get it good thank you had no time for explaining okay next thing you want to do the next thing you want to do is take your make take your makeup station place and uh, take your lip liner. Now that your lips are all plumped, just make sure they're really moisturized, and then you're gonna do your eyeliner. So I'm just gonna look at the camera. I mean my mirror, and line your lips. Don't know how to do this. I'm guessing it's like this. Ooh. Oh damn. My lips my lips are already big and I just made them to ten times bigger. Which is fine. And then I have this trick where when I put foundation on my lips, um, and then I put lipstick on top of the foundation on my lips, it looks more natural. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do that. So put that foundation on your hand and then take it and just put it all over your lips. Like that and then choose what kind of lipstick you want I'm gonna take this one it's called the Ariposa Ariposa lipstick you want some oh, there you go. and um, I got this from Dollarama and I think it was like what three dollars uh, I was like almost broke after that you know so I'm just gonna really just dab it in there. Just really try to make it as natural as I can. There you go. So natural. Okay. And the next thing you wanna do um, is you wanna take another natural color and this one is a little darker, but it goes well with my skin color, as you can tell. Brown twins, you know? Brown people, things. 
and you want to take this and you want to just dab it in there as well this one just makes it go connect with your skin color you know it works for everyone i think and this one just makes me more natural i guess so now natural now my lips look like a natural color like i didn't add anything like See, I added pink, but I also added brown. Brown plus pink mix. Beauty. Okay. Whew. How do beauty gurus do it, man? I mean, this is a full-time job. So I'm going to be taking... I'm going to be searching for a very good pencil. I mean, all these big companies been giving me all these big... Um, big... Um, um, brushes and I have too many but I'll be using the Lori the Lori brush I think you can see it says Lori over here it's called the Lori brush and I um, was given by Dolorama as well and but they made me pay for it and it cost like six dollars uh, no no I have price three dollars as well so get your brushes from Dolorama man I mean, I'll give you guys a discount of $10 off, and it's really, it, they have such good products. So I'm also going to use foundation on my lids first, just because that really helps to start up the whole thing, which is doing my eyelids. Okay. Just put that in there. Now I'm going to use my Color Story Karma palette. I got this from Target when I visited America and I was like, I'm going to get the most bougiest palette and I found it and I was in Target and it was just $10 like, oh my god, like so, so pigmented and I think they're trying to copy ColourPop which was so rude, like don't copy ColourPop but I'm still going to take it. Um, okay, I'm be using, I think I'm going to use the color that matches my skin the most. Oh, anyway, uh, this match the most? No. How about this one? No. Okay, I think that. Okay, I chose this one. So we're going to take that. And I don't know how to do this, but. And just really just put it over your lids. Yes! Uh, you literally can see, can't see anything. <laughs> That's the, honestly the saddest thing I've ever heard today. Okay. Okay. Oh my, I actually look natural. This is kind of like a bronze. I don't know if you can see. Oh. But it, in my view, I mean, it looks very, very natural. It looks like I didn't add anything. So now I'm going to take this thing called happiness. Just gonna dip that in there and just, uh, whew, let's work out. Just put it over here. I think this is called lids. And yeah, and just put it in here. I'm doing so well. I am doing so well. I'm going to cry. And now I think it's. I think it's time for high, um, eyeliner. Don't you guys think it's time for eyeliner? I mean, people use eyeliner every single day, and I'm like, why? And I understand why. I. Um, just a second. Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, got it. Okay, I'm gonna do my eyeliner now. We're gonna be looking like a cat. It's gonna. Oh, can you guys even see? This is gonna go really bad, by the way. I mean, not bad, right? Okay, I can't really show you guys. I mean, 
I could do better, but I won't do better. How about I just do it on one eye? I mean, how about I start a trend of doing eyeliner on one eye? Like, how bad could that trend go? Like, that's probably good. You know that trend where you like add like eyeliner over here? Should I do that? You know that? Okay, I'll just. Look at that. That is what I call creative mind. So I'm just gonna do it on one eye just to be cool and try to blow up by doing a new trend. Okay, so I mean, we're not really missing anything. I mean, we really did the mascara, the highlight, the lips, the eyes. I mean, what are we missing? Like, nothing. Right. Maybe we can just mix that in there a little bit. Oh, powder. Eh, don't have powder. I'm not. Ain't gonna use my powder. Um, how about we just, um, don't really know what to do. Oh. Okay, gonna show you guys the final look. Hey guys, thank you for watching my video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like and please subscribe to my channel. That'd be awesome. I always say awesome, but that actually be really awesome if you if you do. And comment whatever you guys want. Like I'm always active. I'm always gonna see your comments. And I just wanna say thank you for watching my video. And if you're new to my channel, please please subscribe and be tuned for more videos. I'm gonna be really active and I'm gonna try to post as much as I can. And go watch my other videos because they're um they're pretty interesting as well. But yeah, bye y'all.